We've been raided. We had to use fire ammunition because to fend off the robbers. Why wow, people want to keep robbing me? Day 42. Yes. Okay. We have Arisa, who's very hungry. She's gonna go eat. I am also very hungry. Everyone's hungry. Get the food, please. Good morning. A I K Ake Acon Acorn Acon Acon. Hello, A-I-K-O-N-N. Good morning. Welcome to the channel. Thank you for taking a chance and clicking on me. It means a lot to me. Welcome to my community and my channel. Hope you're having a great morning. Pull up a chair. This is This War of Mine. It's an amazing game by 11-Bit Studio. Um, I, it's probably one of my top games this year. Like, it really is, for such a simple concept, it's just so enjoyable. Zalana, you're going to go ahead and eat the canned food and go to bed. I'm out of filters. Oh, we got problems. You're gonna go eat. I already fed you good. Oh. I don't have materials. Materials are gonna kill me. Materials are, are where, where, where it's at right now. That's where our concern is. Um, go get us some more food building. Sleep. Grow more food. Go to bed, please, like I told you to. No, you you go do this. Make us more food so we can keep catching more rat. We don't they don't want to think about the fact they're eating rats for lunch, okay? They just know it tastes really good with some soup and gravy sauce. It's all good. It's all about that secret sauce. Cause I'm the sauce boss. Go to Katia! Will you do listen to what I'm saying? Do you understand the words that are coming out of my mouth? I said go to bed. Who are you and what do you want? Hello? Is anybody there? I need to talk to you. Who are you? What do you want? What do you want? Can I stay here? Oh no. More survivors. I thought I would... Oh, who is this? Savetta. Thank you for answering the door. People tend to be mistrustful of others nowadays. I'm Savetta. I used to be a principal at elementary school. You're probably wondering what the reason for my visit could be. Well, honestly, I'm afraid to be alone in this dreadful situation. Would you mind if I stayed with you? I can take care of any children you might have. I don't have any children! There are no children left here. What are you doing? Oh, God. Come on in. If you're sick, I'm throwing you back outside. Lethally wounded? What happened to you? These people. These people. Get a bandage. Loves children. Oh dear. That is embarrassing. I know I'm not much of an assist in this terrible situation. I have a good administrative and log logistical skills, which won't be of any use given the circumstances. I am told that I'm a good caregiver. I really love kids. On the other hand, perhaps it's good that they don't have to suffer here with us. What else? I have a driver's license. <laughs> Sorry, that was my poor attempt at a joke. I like it. I'm good. Pyrus675, good morning, sir. Welcome to the channel. Thank you for clicking on the channel giving me a chance. If you haven't played this game yet, you really got to. I think it's still on sale at the Humble Store. Um, and it's just this game. Again, one of my top games of the year. I love this title. So much good times. Alright, she's bandaged. I don't know what else I can do for you, doll. Look, I will have one of my people stay awake. So you can go lay down and try to recover. But if you die, it ain't my fault. You came to me like that. I didn't get you shot. I didn't stab you. I didn't do nothing to you. If you die, it's your own fault. I gave you a bandage. You know how expensive that bandage is? Do you have any idea how expensive that bandage is? Do you know what you've done to me and my supplies? Six ninety nine, in the Humble Store? Yes. If, if, you get, if you haven't played this game and you're at all interested, pick it up. Amazing game. So good. Bum, bum. Bands of looters, vegetables, classical music, warm and pleasant. All right. All right. Good. 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 So we can't make a filter. Let's see what else we can do down here. Let's go. 
Uh, nothing here. I don't. I'm not desperate for firewood right now. They said the next few days are gonna be nice and warmy, so that's good. I don't have any saw blades. Left. I should go ahead and make a saw blade in case I find something that I need to cut through. Oh, we know there's that one spot. Was there? Did we ever go back to the construction yard? I remember there being a grate underground that led somewhere. I just can't remember if we ever went back for it. I'll have to check the thing when we uh, get to the night view. I can't remember if we ever went back and finished looting it or not. No water. I imagine I don't have enough thing to make a moonshine. Okay. Nope, no sugar. Go have a seat, go have a seat, go have a seat. Aresia's awake. I wanna hear what Aresia let's see how Aresia plays the plays the guitar. Let's see how she does. She's trying. She's not great at it. She's really trying. She's she putting some effort into it. She's not the greatest. All right, ending the day. <laughs> Not the greatest guitar player, but she's trying. She's putting in an effort. You stay asleep, you bandaged woman who came to me for help. How dare you? Oh, my scavenger, my two guards to protect, protect the teacher, protect the teacher. All right, so, so yeah, it says construction site cleared. Central city. That's the trade place. Military post, there was no way we were getting in there safely. Hospital. We looted most of the stuff in there. They're not gonna let us keep going through there. Oh, man. Some deserters from the army. See, army guys, we know this now, okay? I've lost so many people in battle. Army guys are no bueno. They are not the people we want to mess with. There were people living in the other half. They don't seem friendly. So I think these guys are defeatable. Versus compared to the army people anyway. We're not stealing from the quiet house. I guess we're going <laughs> to... They're going to get all sad and broken if I start killing people again. This is terrible. And I'm out of places. There's nowhere else. And I still need materials. I need parts. could find some useful materials there. I need materials, but there's no way they're going to let me go through their stuff. They might be willing to trade with us. We're going to try trading. We're going to try to play the nice role, and we're going to try trading. We're going to bring all of the cigarettes, because I can make more with the tobacco and they should trade well um, medicine's not gonna save the, the bandage woman taking two of these to trade with and in case things go wrong we're gonna take I need room to trade though we'll take the shotgun and ten bullets just in case things go wrong hopefully we'll trade with that and get some good stuff materials we need materials I have 22 wood still materials we need materials gunpowder would also make more bullets which we know is going to be a problem here soon let's go try to make a trade with some rebels hello Good morning, Cranberry. Ricky Solano, good morning and welcome, sir. Thank you for taking a chance of me clicking my channel. I appreciate it. Hope you're having a great morning. 
or afternoon or evening depending on where you are I wouldn't be right we're not bandits all right so these guys aren't bandits they don't think they want to be evil remember we're here to protect the people not harm them cool I like it all right so we're gonna try to introduce all right I understand don't worry we're gonna try to introduce ourselves and see what happens good it's easy to forget about that during the war time these these seem like good people hello Hello, can I trade with you? Hi, Sob, this school is held by Vazani Militia. We can trade. Yes, I would like to trade, sir. Can I trade with you? I can trade with you. Wait, what did he say? You can back our cause and profit at the same time. Victor! Victor, I have brought you many good things to trade for, Victor. I hear you like cigarettes. Would you like some cigarettes, Victor? I have all the cigarettes for you, Victor. I need... what's he got? No, he has no materials. Victor! We could have been friends! What have you done to me, Victor? Victor, I bring you, I bring you the good stuff. I'm keeping my cigs though, because you gone, you done, you done gone and goofed. You didn't, you didn't, you didn't make me a good offer. So I'm keeping some cigs for my smokers. I'm taking a bandage, which is gonna help our mortally wounded person, which is good. I'm taking some herbs to grow. I'm taking some gear parts, some water, so I can make some more booze. He has no materials. Victor, will you get mad if I go up here? Is it cool, bro? Is it cool if I go up here? Are you just you gonna you gonna stay down there and be happy, go lucky? Anyone in here? Can I, can I, Victor? Can I loot? Can I loot your top floor? Do you mind, Victor? Mr. Victor, I don't want to offend anybody. Oh, there's the there's the gunpowder. Need the gunpowder more than I need the gadget. Get the pop. Victor, am I allowed up here? There's a lot of propaganda leaflets. One of them, there's a symbol of a plane symbol and a message. Do not approach international airdrops. It may be dangerous. Report all airdrops to the nearest militia outpost. Okay. Is there anybody in here? And am I allowed to come in here? It is blocked from the other side. Okay. Am I allowed up on the roof? I am allowed on the roof. Oh, but we have a shovel pile. Do I have enough time to dig through the shovel pile? I don't know if I do, but we'll see. Dag! Dag, woman! The clock is ticking! Dig faster! You can do it! Motivational speeches are inspiring. Use those hands. Get in there deep. Please. I think she'll make it in time. I also like the soundtrack of the game. I feel like they did a really good job on the uh, the, the music for this title. It's a really good time. I like it. I'm on board. Come on! Come on, Aresia! Dig faster! You're supposed to be the quick one! My little mouse that can pop over all the places! Move in the rubble! Move in the rocks! Almost done! It's 1.10 in the morning! 
So there were at least four enemy com enemies, but they're not bad guys. They clearly started off by saying, we are the good guys, we don't want to hurt people. So it would be very foolish of me to do something that would cause them to not want to be my friend. Is there anyone down? Don't jump down there yet! What if they, they're mad at me? I don't want to steal, I want to leave! Nothing here. So the ones, the piles of the hands, I'm allowed to loot without it being called theft. If there's a pile with a little, um, that icon, that means that you're stealing it, and they will get offended if they catch you or see you with the stuff. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, no, 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 please, no. Yes, up, 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 up. Up, 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 up. We made... It wasn't me, I'm sorry. Nope, it wasn't me. It wasn't me. That was some other girl. Some other darn dumb girl coming through your area. We're leaving. And I'm out. Peace! Deuces! I'm, I'm gone. I can't do it. Paul George 18, good morning and welcome, sir. Welcome to the channel. Thank you for taking a chance on me clicking my link. I appreciate it, sir. Hope you're having a great day. We're moving into day 43 here. I've got my four survivors living it strong, trying to trying to just make it through the days. Ugly looking wounds, they seem very serious. I know they're serious. I'm working on it. What do you think I've been doing? Um, so that it won't make it through unless we dress the wound. We need bandages. That's what we just got her was a bandage. Is there anything we can do to save Savetta from bleeding to death? I've lost all hope. What do you mean? She just got here. This is not our problem. I robbed the hospital. I knew this could save Savetta's life. Man, they, they must have really bonded over that first night. I'm just saying, like, they had s'mores. They were hanging out at the campfire. Because they are attached to this Savetta. They're like, you can't, Savetta, you and us, we're going to stick together because we're friends. And everything's going to be cool as long as we have each other. Poor Savetta. Come on, you can do this. Come on. I'm going to give you some food. I'm going to give you another bandage. And then you're going to go back to bed and everything's going to be okay. We got this, Savetta. We got this. Everyone just chill out. Cheer up. 43 days we've met, we've been through. We've lost a couple of friends, but we're we're gonna do it. Put in the bandage on. Bandaged and go back to bed, please. Good night. More food. Yes, please. We will continue to grow rats every chance we get. I think we got. Did we we didn't we grab water, not sugar. We have a lot of water. Bullets, we grab bullet parts so we can make bullets. Which we know are going to be super helpful. Materials! This game and materials! Oh. We done goofed, son. We done goofed. So what we're going to do is, as we have a, a high stockpile of water, we are going to we're going to cook as much food as I can, which is eight food. Though the reason that I'm cooking this much food and going to consume all the water is there's a trick that I've been told for the game where any food that you have cooked can't be raided. Like they'll come in, they can steal all your meds and all your all your uncooked food, but anything that's cooked sitting on the stove they don't touch. So by pre-cooking eight food, no matter what, I've got eight food saved for my party that's not going to get stolen at night and raiding and the raiding appears to be picking up more fr in frequency so I want to make sure I'm protected I'm protecting my party uh, in the event that we do get attacked I'll be there in just two seconds I'm cooking my rat stew please mister I'm gonna come trade with you I just gotta cook the rat stew it's very important it's got mucho vitamins and taste so tasty so tasty Let's go to the door, please, Katia. Open the door. I wonder if there are bad things at the door, because like, so they do, a lot of them do say, should we let them in? And I wonder if that is actually a mechanic of the game. Day 43, DCK, we're making it. We're surviving, please, he brought me materials. <gasps> You're my new best friend, Franco. Franco, I could kiss you. Oh, Franco, you and I. We're going to be best of pals. 
I want all your materials. Every single one, Franco. I'm taking them all. I will give you anything. Uh, look, I have a broken guitar. I'm not making another guitar. Would you like a guitar, Franco? Can I have more materials, Franco, please? He'll give me more materials. Franco, I Franco. Uh, medic, two med I have two meds. How about these first before we get into that part of the trade? And then... Yeah. More materials. Oh, we get a bunch of materials for this stuff. Oh, no gears. Oh, we ran out. Okay. Good. So... The bullets. We need the bullets. So let's get the bullets. Bullets are second most most valuable thing we need. Um, cigarettes. We, can, we have we have we have tobacco. I can grow more cigarettes. So we will give you a bunch of cigarettes if you let me have enough to make some alcohol. And then, do we need? I have coffee for a couple days. I need the vegetables. I can get the vegetables too? Oh, we don't even need to give you that many cigarettes? Dude. Nice. I'm on board with this. I like where this is going. Franco, you're just you you the man, Franco. Alright, what else can what else do we want from Franco? I got vegetables for when I need to cook next, which is gonna be good. Um, he has pure alcohol, which I don't... Pure alcohol can make more bandages if I get in trouble, and it's probably cheaper than trying to trade for a pure bandage. Let's see what he wants for that. 13 gears, 11 gun pieces. Good on all that. How many cigarettes for... No. Okay. Not interested. Um, food? Two food can get it though. Okay. 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 Show you that I show you want to play that game. I say we go ahead and get the wood so that we have it. Because that's just the pure resources are right now what we're going to need if we're going to continue trying to upgrade or advance the base at all. We need more pure resources, so. What can we give him for that? I wonder how many books you actually need. I don't know if I need this many books that I have. Thank you. Franco, you're the man! I love you, Franco. Please don't get shot by snipers. It would be a very bad time if you get shot by snipers. Or you see a cigarette duty. Um, oh. Alright, so we haven't seen the garden yet, so we have, we're going to make the garden. Uh, which we're gonna put. I don't think I have any room anywhere else. I can put it by the rat traps. Sure, let's just. Growing more food by the rat traps? That sounds like it would just draw more rats to it. I don't know if it has that mechanic in the game, but it makes logical sense to me. Uh, we, so, yes, we, we can make a bandage. The first thing first. Oh, but materials. I only have nine materials of building that. And I need four for our filter. All right, cigarettes. I wonder if, it, if there's no way to get materials. I wonder the best way to get materials this late in the game. Like I scavenged, I guess that's supposed to where we get, sorry, let me rephrase that. I guess that's supposed to be how it is. The further you go, the harder it is to get resources. Like I have food now, I can survive, but I'm not really developing anymore because of the resource drain. Got that, got that. Again, wooden resources. So what can we grow? We can grow fertilizer. I can grow fertilizer. Or I can grow a herb. So I can't make vegetables until tier, tier 2. Well, that was a waste.
Oh no, I didn't let Katia, Katia sleep tonight, today. Uh, I still, see, even now, I still making mistakes. I'm from day 43, you think I would have learned the system mechanics by now, and no. She, there's no way she's gonna get enough sleep in, in, in two hours before tonight. I done goofed, son. I done goofed. Okay. Water on the stove. So on the bright side, I think everything that I can build in the game is built. I only have, but I only have two things that I can even upgrade. That's not true. The alcohol distillery we haven't built yet. That would be the other thing we haven't built. Because our money's been in water production, boost production, and weapon production. Which is, I guess, not bad, because weapons sell for buku bucks, but the materials you need. Ugh, oh, the materials. I don't have enough water? Are you kidding me with this? Are you kidding me? How you doing? Just bandaged and recovering still. Okay. In the day. Arc Hyrule. Hello, good morning, welcome, sir. Afternoon, evening, depending on where you are. But welcome to my channel. Thank you for taking the chance and clicking the link. And good morning. What's my morning? I'm gonna say good morning for me. But hello and welcome. Um. Yeah, you're. I know you're tired. You're sleeping. Gar, we're gonna get attacked tonight, though. I'm gonna let you sleep tomorrow. I gotta have you on guard tonight. We gotta go out hunting. Oh, what do we have left? I don't want to kill the son and the father. That's the central city. There's that other area of the central city that they wouldn't let me into before. I know I can go and get food. Did they, were they trading parts? I think we're gonna go to the hospital and we're gonna see what we're allowed to break. We're gonna take this just in case. We'll take, oh no, I don't think there's anything I needed to break into. And if so, we can, was there? And we're gonna take some cigarettes to trade. The doctor fellow. And some medicine is what they really wanted, so we're going to take that too. And we're going to pray they trade materials. Let's go. Let's do this! Night 43! Hello! Hi, can I help you? Yes, I can help. I'm here to help. If you find any medical supplies in the rubble, return them to the doctor. Yes, sir! Wait, what is it? We lost the last. Please help us. Oh, I hear people crying. I've got my eye on you. Yes, sir. Now, let's see. Do they get after the... Sh so, there's the traitor. That's right. Sh I can bring... Oh, I can... Oh, man. I can bring... What's her name? And get her healed from the doctor. I forgot all about that. Oh. I should have brought the injured lady with an axe. Oh, I made mistakes. Okay. Yes, he does have some materials. Sweet! They don't want cigarettes. Cool. So he's really happy. He really, 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 really wants the meds. Um, materials, which are fantastic. Can I have... If you come to the wrong place, don't be ridiculous. Okay. 
that's an offer I expect from a decent person, so he still calls me a decent. Sure, it's an honest exchange. Okay, that's fine. I'll stick with decent. So two wood. Let's put back one of these. There you go, buddy. Have I have? Do I have more meds? I don't have more meds. Can I break this without you getting mad? No one's screaming. Anyone gonna come beat me up for this? All right, cool. So I, there's plenty of things they can come and chop up here, and they will. Don't mess with me. What's going on with this guy? I asked if I could cut this open. No one, no one gave me any complaints. You guys said I could do this. Don't get mad at me now, please. I really can't afford to lose another survivor. Mucho important that I keep people. Alright, let's go see. So I came here once. I don't remember if there was anywhere... Oh, someone just ran away. Whoa, 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 why are you running at me? What's happening? It's all I can do, there's not enough medicines. That's a steal point, we're not gonna steal. We're not here to steal. I could break the bed the guy's sleeping in. That would be funny for me. Drop down. I would laugh. I'd probably then get shot, but it would be funny. Rubble pile. Nothing worth taking. Oh, we can't go that way because that's oh, that's the destroyed part of the building from. I remember. I remember. And there was the shovel. Okay. I don't have a shovel, but I have enough time that I can clear it manually since I don't really have anything else I have to get and I have a full inventory, so we'll take the rest of the night to go ahead and clear the pile so I don't have to come back with a shovel to do it. So again, if you guys have any questions about the game or anything at all that you want to ask me, just let me know. I'm here for you guys. Thank you again for being here this morning. It means a lot to me. If you haven't yet, please make sure to check my information down below. Uh, I have my Twitter link and my YouTube, and you can please follow me on both Twitter and YouTube. Uh, I'm currently uploading this entire playthrough series uh, one episode at a time. There'll be another episode up tonight. There are currently seven on the channel, I believe. Um, your support really does mean everything to me. Like You guys make this very enjoyable. It's a good time. Go 366139. Good morning, sir. Welcome to the channel. Thank you for taking a chance on me clicking my channel. It means a lot. I hope you're having a great day. If you have any questions, let me know. But I tweet out every morning when I go live, so it's a great way to. It's a, oh my god, words. It's a great way to know when I'm going live. Sim. Simba Paz one Thank you so much for the follow, my friend. I appreciate it. Welcome. Thank you. You guys are awesome. I love you. So, again, you can follow me on Twitter. I tweet every time I go live. It's a great way to know when I'm going live. My YouTube is going to have new content. I'm aiming to put something new on my YouTube channel every day from what I did the day before. So, I'm hoping that... And I'm, I'm learning Sony Vegas. So I'm learning how to properly edit and try to slowly make more quality productions. So, again, if you like what you see, please take some time hang out with me. It'll mean a lot, and uh, I hope we can be friends. The friend zone medicine. The guy wanted some medicine. He said, please bring it back to the doctor. Please don't disturb the patients. They are in stock. I haven't disturbed anyone. Just coming through. I'm going to go give the guy the medication that I found. I'm not causing any trouble. Why is everyone so mean? I just want to be your friends. The shelling, I don't want to remember. <laughs> hey, bro. Hey, bro. Look, bro. Look. Look, bro. It's going to be okay, man. It's going to be okay. Look. Look, man. Hey, listen. Listen, okay? For you. Look what I bring you. Look what I bring you. And I'm just gonna take. I'm just gonna take. Look, I'm just gonna take. I'm just gonna take the. Um, the pick. Good karma, right? Good karma. Thank you. Maybe. We're, maybe we'll have fewer deaths tonight. You're welcome, man. You're welcome. I hope. I hope it really does help, man. Lady, come to him. I gave him more medicine to save the dude. I gave you more pills. I made a. Uh, I gave you more medication. It's gonna be okay. I'm leaving. Bye, guys. Good luck not letting everyone die from the bombing. I hope you'll be okay. 
I may come back tomorrow so you can heal my person if she's not healed today. That or I'm cutting off her leg. I found plenty of really fine stuff. What a night. Hey, girl. Oh, no, we've been attacked. Someone tried to rob us. They were armed with a band of ruthless, ruthless looters. We managed to fend them off. Thankfully, we were all armed. None of us were wounded. Thank God the attackers didn't steal anything. We were to defend ourselves. Savetta is feeling much better. Thank also God. But my bullets! You took eight bullets, guys. You had to shoot eight bullets to save the house. Team! How many bullets do you think we have left? We have to keep an eye on her. Alright, 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 alright. How you doing? Wounded in recovery. So she could definitely use another bandage. Alright, come on. Get up. Go get the last bandage. We'll make another one. It'll be okay. Very hungry. Please eat. You. Very hungry. Please come downstairs. You. Very hungry. Very tired. Go ahead and go to bed right now. Put down the coffee. Go to sleep. Good night. No, actually, you'll start the bandage. Yep. We'll take it. Eat. So because I'm consuming my last bandage, I'm gonna prepare, I'm gonna prep another one just in case we get in trouble. I want to have one ready to go. Good. Get the food. Good. Good night. Yeah, you're going to lay down. You're going back to bed. We're going to heal you. This is your fault, okay? You came to me all beaten up and wounded. Three days I've spent trying to heal you, Savetta. Three days. You don't even have any skills. You just love children. You're useless to me. It's terrible. Uh, do I want to make a fertilizer? No, I don't want to make a fertilizer. I don't have anything I can use it for. It would make me benefit at this point. Is there a bed still open? Good night, Aresia. I'll see you in an hour when you wake up. Hungry and tired. Tough noodles. Made another bandage, which is good. Put the other another water on the filter. Get some more aqua going. Then we're gonna check the radio. The radio. Whoa, whoa. Let's do this. So we got. Oh, someone's at my door. Is anyone there? I need help. Oh, great. What do you want, man? Look, everyone's sleeping here. So unless you're gonna wait for them to wake up, this is not gonna go well for you. Turtle, Burg, Burglar J, hello, welcome. <laughs> hello to ja CZNY, how are you doing? Welcome to the channel, hope you're having a great day. Turtle, Burglar J, <laughs> I like your name, Turtle. Welcome, guys, good morning, thank you for clicking on my channel, it means a lot to me, hope you're having a great day. If you have any questions about the game or the title, let me know. We're currently on day 44 on my first playthrough, we're doing good. We've, we've stabilized everything. I've lost every male survivor that's joined my community, but all the women, they're doing strong. we got some strong women going on in this crew. We're going to make it. Can you help me board up my windows? I live nearby with my daughter. I've heard rumors of looters pillaging the houses and raping women. I can lock the doors, but they can still get in through the windows. Can you help me board them up? My husband, taken by the rebels in the first year of the war, hasn't returned yet. We're all alone. Please help us. Come with us! Like, come live with us! I got room! Just give me a second. That's it. No, no, no. Um, huh, yeah, I guess you're gonna go. You can bolster their spirits while you help them board up the windows. Go! I'm coming to help. Don't turn your back on me. I'm not. I'm coming to help you. Yes. Let's go. If you've got someone waiting for me there and you shoot my person, we're gonna be. I'm gonna be so mad at you. Katia, our neighbor, was right to ask for our help. We will help her house. Make we will help make her house more secure. Why not just bring them in here? I've got food. I can feed you. We couldn't leave our neighbor without help. She was really scared. Of course, you're all gonna think this. You're a bunch of women. Our neighbor looked really worried about her own about her own and her daughter's safety. I'm glad we decided to help them. Oh, the crew that I'm running with. The crew. Okay, everything's cooking, everything's cooking. We got medication made. Everything's good. 
that was our daily event. So we're going to end the day and go into our night cycle. She still has to sleep. Uh, I need to guard because they're still a good. We're, we're still in very hostile time, so I can't risk getting attacked. So we're going to double guard it. We're going to stay home tonight. Be safe. Hoping we get a trader tomorrow so we can trade for some more materials. There's a lot of have to nail, but her windows return safely. Cool. She came back safe. She did it. She has to go to bed now. Yep. Very tired. Good night. You need to eat your dinner. You need to go to sleep. Slightly wounded. Okay. You need to eat today, but you're not getting any more medication. I'm sorry. For slightly wounded, I will wait the extra days and let you just sleep away your pain. It's going to be the best answer for you. I don't have any more material. I can't do that. I do. Hey, more filters. And then you go ahead and wake up and come eat, and then I'll put you back to bed. Cooking me some nummy, eating me some food. All right, hungry. You know what? Because you're wounded, I'm gonna let you go ahead and get full and then sleep. I think that heals. I think she'll heal faster if she's got a full stomach. So. We're going to go ahead and let her eat all the way up, and then go to bed, and that'll heal her. Um, let me go see if I can make some moonshine now that I've got water prepped. We've still got three food left, which is good. We have seven food there. We're still growing four more, so we've got a potential. We've got a potential of 11 food prepped. A vegetable makes another one, plus the canned food makes 15 food. So we're, we're like survivability-wise, I can survive. I've got enough wood stockpiled and book stockpiled. I can I can actually survive pretty well if we need to um, for let's say if there's nowhere safe to scavenge we just need to bunker bunker down and, and last I've got at least a 10 day cycle um, of where we can sh we can border up and be safe which I think is good I think we're we are ahead of the curve in that aspect go have a seat have a nice relaxing break for a second are you done with what you're doing can you Go sleep now. Good night, Katia. Everyone's doing great today. Very proud of my team. Go team! Can you go to bed a little faster? Like, you're the slowest person ever. Aresia, can we see if anything's changed on the radio, please? Radio. Whoa, whoa. Day 45. Still the same. We are led to believe that the international peacekeepers are going to put an end to the civil war in Gar Gray's Navia in the upcoming days. Does, does that mean I'm about to win the game? Am I gonna win? We have confirmation that the Peter Forces are indeed in the route. The, they're coming, guys! The end is near! The peacekeepers are coming! We can do this! We expect ceasefire any day now. We're gonna make it. We are surviving. Gonna make it to the end. The war is over. Hurrah, we win. I'm the winner. Team, we did it! Team! We shaved her, we shared her food with a starving man. We saved the girl from the drunken soldier. We reinforced the shelter, yep, helped the friends. I like this kind of nice little timeline thing. Bruno died. 
Bruno, why? Bruno! And then Pave will die trying to avenge Bruno because they don't know how to stab. I'll have a highlight of all the deaths. Um, up, um, hopefully, hopefully it, it probably won't be tonight. It'll probably be tomorrow, but I'm going to have a highlight of just the deaths. Blood on our hands. We murdered the... the he wasn't defenseless. He killed two of my survivors. How is that defenseless? <sighs> Rebel soldiers, we didn't turn in our neighbors for stealing the supplies. Because cause snitches get stitches. We got Boris on the team. He encountered several bandits and managed to take him out. Good job, Boris. Then we helped our... we No, so this one... Um, they went, we robbed a rich family because they wouldn't trade or share with anyone. Then Boris got killed by the military because we got too aggressive again. Boris, I'm sorry. You're the last male of my party. <sighs> we, we did not raid the hospital because they're trying to help people. So we, we chose to leave the hospital because we wanted them to... They were actually trying to help people. They weren't just being stingy with their supplies. That's why. We helped our neighbor blow up the house because they were playing for help. And then the ceasefire... We did it, peace! The long away ceasefire finally came into force, eventually putting an end to the fighting in Porygon. Uh, those who managed to the war will never forget it. We win! We win! Oh, we get, we get conclusion stories? <gasps> Katia used her contacts to find her parents in the refuge camp abroad. She returned to her city, but they... What? They refused? And once again, they were separated? After a few years, they passed away, and only then did Katia find the determination to publish her war diary? What? That's not a good ending. The war didn't extinguish the flame that drove Saveta to give everything into her calling, and one day she got a visit from her former pupil, the same who made the frantic call one Friday to make sure that her old school had recently been evacuated. After the war, Aresia gave her father a symbolic funeral and kept his picture. Despite the horrors she witnessed, she managed to start a family and tried to get a better parent than, or tried to be a better parent than her father had been. Good job, Aresia. I appreciate that. That's a good ending. Someone got a good ending out of this. Salada survived the war and was reunited with her brother in Canada. Salada, Canadians stuck together. Good job. Took her some time to adjust to the new reality, but she found a job and she even resumed her music studies. Nice. At the Royal Conservatory in Toronto. Despite the violent struggle, Bruno didn't make it through the war. His fate of his friend he was worried about still remains unknown. Sadly, Pavel died and... Will his family come back to Portagon to visit the grave one day, or will it be too painful? A reminder of what they had gone through. Do the dead even care? Ooh, that's a strong question at the end there. Luke has finally abandoned... What? Luck has finally abandoned Boris. Not much of a surprise for him. His strength was not enough to keep him alive. In a just universe, he will be with his son now. Oh, Boris, your backpack. We love your backpack, Boris. You have the best backpack ever. What? There's an epilogue? What is that? Oh, is it just the same thing? You survived. Yeah, it's just a summary of my survival. We did it, team! We did it! We made it to the end!